There is a good news and a bad news. The good news is Vimos is working with Pokemon Go again. And the bad news is that if you used your main account, you will get a red warning with a strike disclaimer. And that strike disclaimer will can be your first, second or third. And if you get a first strike, it will be for 4 days and if you get a second strike, it will last uh, 30 days, a temporary ban. And if you get a third strike, your account might be in danger. So in this video, I'm going to create another account, a new account and use it to spoof in Vmos and I'm going to, I'm going to show you how to use Vmos and uh, spoof in Pokemon Go again. So let's dive deep into it. So first of all, uh, I'm not going to show you how to install Vmos from Play Store, how to import a Lucky Patcher, Root Browser or Pokemon Go and the GPS joystick app. Uh, I'm not going to show you all that in this video. I've made a video previously named Spoof with Vmos. You guys can check that out and then come back to this video and get the update on how to spoof without getting the unable to authenticate error. So let's start. First, what you gotta do is uh, log into your Pokemon Go uh, with your main OS and make sure that your uh, location is turned off and you are actually logged in with your new account. Create an account beforehand with Google and log Okay. Now let's fire up the Pokemon Go app. So there you go. Now you can spoof again within Vmos. And uh, if you have any problems or any questions regarding this video, just comment down below. I'll be really happy to help. 
and if you don't want to use your um, new account and if you want to use your main account to play Pokemon Go or Spoof uh, I'm actually uploading another video and in that video I'm going to show you a fully ban proof and safe method to play Pokemon Go on your main OS not in Vemos so subscribe and uh, give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it I'm gonna upload that video tomorrow stay tuned for that peace